In this section, we're going to talk about the difference between routing versus forwarding. Routing is equivalent to building maps and giving directions, whereas forwarding is simply moving packets between the interfaces according to those directions. When we talk about IP forwarding, we mean that the router decides which interface a packet is sent to. The forwarding table is usually populated by the routing process. Forwarding decisions are based on the destination address, the class of service, and other local requirements such as packet filtering. Forwarding is usually aided by special hardware. As you can see from the diagram on the screen, different routing tables feed the forwarding table. You have several routing tables on the right half of the screen, such as the BGP4 routing table, the ISIS local routing information base, the OSAF local routing information base, connected routes, and static routes. The best path from each of these routing tables are used to create the global routing table, which is then used to generate the forwarding table. The forwarding information base is the forwarding table. It contains the destination addresses, the interfaces, and the next up addresses to get to those destinations. It is built from the router's global routing information base. The forwarding information base is used by the router to figure out where the packet is sent to. In Cisco IOS, you can check the forwarding information base by typing show IP Ceph. The global routing information base is the routing table built from the routing tables of all the routing protocols, static routes, and connected routes of a router. Please note that different vendors tend to give different priorities to different routing protocols. The global routing information base contains all the known destinations and the next hops used to get to those destinations. One destination can have a lot of possible next hop addresses, but only the best next hop address goes into the global routing information base. Global routing information base is used to build the forwarding information base. With Cisco IOS, you can look at the global routing information base by typing show IP route.